we've been defining some of the most important basic concepts for understanding human cultures and behavior. One that's been in the news lately is the difference between sex and gender. Let's start with sex, which is rooted in biological components like chromosomes, hormones, and secondary sex characteristics. You might be surprised to learn that there are not just two, but at least five biological sexes. People can be born with more than two chromosomes, have various hormonal conditions, and there's a wide range of variation in physical attributes like breast and genitalia. Once again, human variation is more complicated than many of us were taught. So why does this matter? It matters now perhaps more than ever as some people are being persecuted and legislated against based on a misunderstanding of sex and gender in some Western cultures. Claiming that there are just two sexes, male and female, is a decision made by a culture at a moment in time, not a biological fact. Babies born in the US with ambiguous sex used to have that decision made for them by doctors forcing them into a binary sex category. But more recently, many parents are letting their kids decide how they identify once they're old enough. Many non-Western cultures were more accepting of these differences, and we'll dive into that next time.